So where in the desert can you hike three miles to see a waterfall like this? Join us and we'll take you there. Today, we're in South Central Utah and we welcome you to Grand Staircase Escalante National Monument. Let's go. Today we're at Calf Creek Falls. Six mile round trip, minimal elevation change. We'll be arriving at the end and hopefully someone's gonna jump in the water. And by the way, I need to add one more thing. This is the trailhead that you see right here. And how about that? That is our tent site right over there on the Calf Creek itself. What a beauty. So as we pass by these beautiful Gamble Oaks right here, um, Calf Creek Falls is the lower fall that we're going to. There's also an upper falls, not as tall. The one that we're trying to hit on this trip will be 126 feet. This is also probably when you consider trails at Grand Staircase, one of the most popular ones. really fascinating out here in Utah are all the marks that the indigenous people have left behind. We have some pictographs behind me. I'll show them when I zoom into you, but it's amazing to think whatever dye they used to create those whereby they would last this long, hundreds of years and still be in existence today. Petroglyphs are what we often see here in Utah, which are the little dots that they carve into the rock and create another design. But these are absolutely amazing. And uh, each one of them tells a story. And uh, archaeologists have scratched their head for many years to try to figure out what the natives were trying to teach us or them during that time. Some say religious, some say it was a warning, some say it was a map to guide a person to a certain direction. But we'll never know, and some things are better left mysteries. All right, Josh. Yes. So if you go in the water right now, full body plunge, I promise you that I'll use that for the thumbnail of this video. <laughs> Is that enough motivation for you? Are you considering it, John? Oh, I think I've pulled in 50. You'll be on the thumbnail of this video if you go in right now. I heard the word doable out of your mouth. I, I wasn't it mistaken. Is, I think it is doable. You know what? I'm telling you. Your grandkids, no, your great grandkids will be talking about this. Yeah. <laughs> He's thinking yeah. about it. Yeah. That's, uh, you know, that's, that's quite a tempting offer, but I don't think so. No go on that one, yeah, huh? No, no go. You'll be a legend back at the church. If there was a shot, no. I'll, I'll, even, I'll tell you what, thumbnail, and I'll even use you in a sermon <laughs> as an illustration. That's of a man that is not crazy, but a man that is you, brave you sweet, and courageous. You sweeten the pot. <laughs> 
you definitely sweeten the pot with that one. That's <laughs> very tempting. I think John's more on the verge of doing it than I would be. Really cold Josh, water you don't think you do? I just, do I just don't What's want that? you guys to get back to the campsite and live with regret yeah, the rest of your lives. That would be horrible. If I, I mean, could, I could take the, the top, camera. I'd be way more likely to do I it. I could take the camera if you wanted to give it a go. Yeah, Randy. I know. I'm just, that I'm prone to sinus infections when cold water yeah. gets up my nose. And <laughs> we still have five days left on this trip. You can go as I wouldn't want to ruin it for you guys. You know, yeah, I am yeah. your tour guide. You can just go up to your neck, but that'd be good. Tonight we got chicken teriyaki rice made with premium white chicken, <laughs> an array of vegetables, some rice. The green beans don't look quite like they do on the package, uh, but it's a solid dinner. It's a solid. I would give it a. I'd give it an eight point two. <laughs> Josh, you got the the bison ranch special yeah, or something? Bison didn't you? ranch mashers. I picked it because of the calorie count. You know, I want a lot of calories. Eleven hundred twenty calories. Nice. How's it taste? It's pretty good, you know. I mean, for freeze-dried food, you dump water into it. You, know, you know, I think you, I think they did about the best job you can for that. So, yeah, I'd eat it again. And you went with the uh, America Sparks favorite, the yeah. chicken teriyaki rice. Yeah, this is. Uh, it says our premium meals are formulated to deliver the amazing taste you would expect on any adventure. And in your America's expert opinion, <laughs> would you say it delivered the amazing taste for you? <laughs> I mean, for an America's Parks adventure, I think we decided it's about maybe seven to eight out of ten. <laughs> oh, in America's Parks, usually does peanut butter and tuna fish. This is a, a significant upgrade. <laughs> yeah. And we have set a record, too, folks, by the way. Two nights and two fires. But uh, we got an incredible campsite here right on that stream. And uh, how cool was it to have a campsite that was like 40 yards away from the trailhead? Yeah, Benny, I don't walking. think I've ever done that before. Yeah, walking off the trailhead, Soon walking tents. to your campsite. That's it, never yeah. done that. You gotta get in the car, drive somewhere, then yeah. set up your tent. Yeah. So. All right, guys, great day today. Awesome day. Yeah. yeah, amazing day. 12 miles in today. Appreciate you guys, a lot of fun, good memories. Good stuff. <laughs> So we are here at Lower Calf Creek Falls at Escalante, all by ourselves. Really an impressive hike. Thanks so much for watching this video all the way to the end. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to America's Parks. And remember, here at America's Parks, always room for you on every national park adventure. You have a great day.